State Court where we seven men are expected to appear today here in court in relation to the case of murder and kidnapping of Andy Lembutu. You'll remember that plane, Andy Lembutu was reported missing on the 28th of last month when the community members of Hambanati started searching for this young boy after the video surfaced on social media uh, showing the boy beaten and was in a pool of blood in one of uh, the, the tavern in the local uh, residence. But uh, today we are expecting the owner of that tavern to appear in court. But la during the last appearance, there was a challenge in relation to them being brought to court for a reason being that there are restrictions that are saying that uh, prisoners or awaiting trials are not allowed to be moving in and out of prison. So we are not sure whether today they will, be, they will appear in court or they will also appear via a video your link as we understand that this is the situation that is happening in most of the courts during uh, this time. But uh, I will just ask my colleague Unom Plengubani just to show you uh, that uh, the court, as you see in court, there are people waiting outside. They are waiting to, 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 to be allowed inside because the security guards and the police officers, they are calling the names of the suspects and the names of the witnesses. They are the people who are firstly allowed inside the court, even the family members of Mbutu, they are also arrived here in court. They are just waiting for the police officers to call them so that they can go inside the court and listen maybe to the bail application or just listen to what is happening so far. But just to, to, to recap, Blaine, Mbutu's uh, body or believe, the, the, the body that was found on the, on the river, or Tongati River, just days after Mbutu was missing, it's believed that it belongs to Andile Mbutu, but the DNA testing is still waiting to be done or the results has not yet come back to the family to confirm or maybe deny that that was not important but for now we're just waiting for the police confirmation in relation to the dna and then the family will be able to get a closure so in terms of that uh, and something that we picked up from from reporting from Vusi kumalo saying that the dna uh, results uh, are yet to be provided that, does that mean that uh, he's not been buried yet? How is the family reacting to this? The results are still not yet uh, uh, given back to the family because they are still uh, undergoing the laboratory test. And so for now, the family has not buried their loved one and they are still waiting for those results. Even them, they just were looking forward to this trial. They, they want to see uh, these seven accused inside, the, 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 in, inside uh, the, the, the jail because they believe that they acted uh, gruesomely when they attacked the boy during uh, that time of which they don't believe that uh, the, the the boy was uh, they don't believe the story that the boy stolen the alcohol during at uh, that time because it was locked down and the tavern was not operating and the family want to see the the accused not getting bail for now staying inside custody until the trial is over Talk to us about the community of Londi. Uh, is it still tense there? Uh, the community, you remember playing that the community, after the body was discovered on that uh, river, the community went to a rampage and they went to the a tavern and they bent down that place calling on the police minister Begikele to come and visit them because they believe that the police station in that area is not doing its job so they called on the police minister and the police minister also arrived days later to meet with the family to meet with the police uh, uh, station to try and understand the situation because not on this issue only that they are complaining about the police station it seems as if there are many incidents that are reported by the committee members and the police did not act on those uh, reports so the police uh, the community still believes that there's a need for a new personnel or other they, they must be deployed new personnel in that station right so just to recap uh, Mlondi, there are seven accused and one of them is a minor correct <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
There are seven accused plane. One of them is a minor of uh, 16 or 15 years old. And then the tavern owner is also part of this accused. And it's believed that uh, the other accused are employed by him because it seems as if they are working at this tavern. All right. I'm Lonnie Khadebe, live person, uh, person in the tell. Thank you very much indeed for your reporting, sir. We'll come back to you a little later on to get an update uh, with regards to this case.